There was a significant disruption on the Montana House floor on Monday as protesters in the gallery began shouting and chanting, let her speak, as House Speaker Matt Regeer again declined to recognize Missoula Representative Zoe Zephyr on the floor. Let her speak! Let her speak! Let her speak! The issue that drove Monday's protest goes back to last week when Zephyr, a transgender woman, spoke on the floor about a bill to ban gender-affirming medical procedures for transgender youth. She said lawmakers who voted for the bill should be ashamed and would have blood on their hands. After that, Speaker Regeer said he had concerns that Zephyr wouldn't maintain decorum if he called on her, and he was using his authority as Speaker not to recognize her to speak on the floor. Zephyr's supporters say Regeer's decision is depriving her constituents of their voice in the House. On Monday morning, they delivered a petition with more than 3,000 names urging him to change his decision. At noon, they held a rally on the Capitol's front steps, again saying, let her speak, and raising a banner reading, democracy dies here. So I'd say the best and easiest next step is for Speaker Regeer to wrap this to a close and begin to allow Representative Zephyr to do her job on the floor once again. Beyond that, I think only, t only time will tell. Zephyr said she was sent to Helena to speak for her constituents and her community, and she planned to keep doing it. At 1 p.m., the House began its daily floor session. More than 100 people filled the gallery. We have rules for our members as well as our guests. Guests, please no cheering, booing, signs, noises of any kind. The gallery is for observation only. Our committee meetings are for public interaction. We welcome you to the Montana House. Zephyr again attempted to speak in debate over a bill when Regeer again decided not to recognize her and the House voted not to overturn his decision. That's when the protesters began shouting. Let her speak! Let her speak! Let her speak! And what you're watching here is you're watching people who do not want to see democracy in action. They want to strip us of our rights and it's not enough for them to get the harmful bills through. When someone stands up and calls out their bills, for the harm they cause, for the deaths they cause. They want silence, and we will not be complicit in our eradication. Lewis and Clark County Sheriff Leo Dutton said seven people were arrested for criminal trespass, and that he expected all of them would be booked and released without bond. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.